We going underground, 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 going underground, going. All them hustles in the streets, we trying to reach it. You been grinding, now it's time to let the world see you. It's the underground, yeah. It's the underground. Titanium underground. What's up, Titanium Underground? This is RJ Bates. Uh, just pulled into my garage. About to go say hi to the kiddos, but wanted to jump on here and talk to y'all real quick about a couple days that I've noticed and been going through personally with Titanium Investments. Um, no problem. I shouldn't say no problem. Very few problems cannot be solved with just taking massive action. And... You know, we, we've had some issues. 2019 was a trying year for us. We had to make a lot of adjustments. Um, you know, we took down a lot more properties in 2019 than we had in previous years. We had done a lot more wholesaling previously. Um, we had some growing pains, and we're having to recover from that. And what I'm seeing right now is, is every time we have a bad day, we follow that up the next day with taking massive action and just generating activity. Whether that be putting out content, uh, you know, posting on social media about what you're doing to generate opportunities for JV opportunities, leveraging a relationship, uh, generating more leads. You know, I, I'm just looking at everything that we're doing and it's all because everybody on the team's reaction to needing change is based around taking massive action. I looked at, you know, 2019, we did very few retail, real estate, realtor activity through Titanium Realty. Titanium Realty was basically nothing more than us listing our own flips or properties on the market. Cassie has built relationships with people and she's working, I think, seven or eight either buyer's rep or listings that have nothing to do with titanium investments. But this is a way to, to just generate another form of income for all of titanium as a whole. You know, we're, we're out there, we're, we're utilizing relationships, listening to what people are telling us. We had a Next Level Flipping member talk about a, a strategy that they've taken with land deals within the group. And I'm not going to go into too many details because that's private for the Next Level Flipping group. But through that, we generated a lead, not because of that, it was just organic we had a lead come through. We reached out to that relationship, and now that could generate income for us. That otherwise, that lead, we would not have been able to do anything with. It just kind of shows that to solve problems in your business, don't sit there and lick your wounds, feel sorry for yourself, buckle down, show up earlier, leave later, take massive action, the results will come. And, you know, we haven't generated necessarily the results we want, but because of the activities that we have taken, we have opportunities in front of ourselves right now to change the landscape of how we're feeling, right? Because that's really all this is. The results haven't been what we wanted recently. So we have feelings of, you know, almost kind of feeling sorry for ourselves. You know, like, man, we work hard every day. Why aren't we getting the results that we want? Well, instead of sitting there and saying that to ourselves, everybody on the team is taking the activity to just buckle down, take that activity, uh, that extra step, work a little bit harder, work a little bit longer, and now we're starting to see opportunities come our way. You know, JV opportunities on land, J with multiple people, Funny enough, majority of them are with that next level flipping. Uh, we have multiple JV opportunities 
uh, we're, we're helping out a buddy of ours who's sick right now. We're helping out with leads that he's generating. Uh, we've got an apartment complex that we're looking to close on soon. Uh, just generating that activity and taking that massive action has helped us so much. So if you're in a rut right now and you're feeling like you need a change, buckle down, really look at the activity that you're taking, take away some of the distractions and make sure everything that you're doing on a daily basis is a revenue generating activity that can change that landscape for you, okay? I hope this helps somebody out there. Um, I know that it's, it's generic, but at the end of the day, it's truthful and it's what we're doing. There's no secret sauce to this. We're just buckling down and working harder. Same things that we were doing six months ago. We're just doing a couple of hours harder, longer, being more focused, you know, staying off of social media a little bit unless we're using it as a revenue generating activity and just really staying focused on what we can do to change the way we feel. All right, guys, hope you enjoyed this. I hope it helps somebody out there. That's the whole point that's putting out these, these podcasts and these videos. So stick with it and just keep taking massive action. All right, guys, we'll talk to you soon.